All right. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Uh, welcome to the Jimmy at Home with Fitness Adaptations channel. And um, today is leg day. So uh, uh, for a lot of my clients, this is their favorite day. And uh, so I am Fitness Adaptations. And the first thing we're going to do is get started with the whole process, the whole system and how it works. First five minutes. I, when we're live, I dedicate this to the members who join in, jump in live. And uh, if you're doing this in replay, want to get straight to the workout, skip to about minute five and a half. For everybody else, if you're doing this live, we're going to get started at the five to five and a half minute mark. And we're going to get started with the pre-warm-up. So welcome, everybody. Uh, let's talk about uh, what to expect from, from the workouts. Number one. Make sure that you have a program. If you need a program from me, go to my website, trainercarlos.com. You have, you have um, a little banner that says, work with me, all right? Do you wanna work with me? If uh, you wanna create your own program, go to my website. There's a Fitness for Life program, the free version. You can do that. But have a program, have a purpose, have a reason to come to these workouts. Uh, make sure that you have plenty of liquids to drink while you're working out. Anytime you see me drinking water, anytime you see me drinking anything, I want you to drink as well so you can stay hydrated through this entire workout. Make sure you have the right equipment, the right weight. If you have the right program, you know what weight you should be lifting. But if you don't have a lot of weights, then you work with what you got. Be patient with the workouts. Uh, be patient with the technique. Be patient with exercises that you don't understand. Just don't give up and take ideas from the pre-warm-up. Take simple exercises. And if there's an exercise out of these right here that you can't do, just go to one of the easy exercises that you can do. Whether it's body weight or with weights, you can always do something. As long as you're moving, it doesn't matter. As long as you're doing jumping jacks, you're running in place, you're doing air squats. As long as you're moving, you can substitute a simple exercise for a complicated one that you're not able to do at this moment. All right. So Kelly, good morning. Kelly, good morning. Olgita, good morning. Um, so again, be patient. It takes a little while. It might take two to three months before you are completely on the ball, on point with your lifting, with your nutrition, with your supplementation. Everything takes time. It's not as easy as a lot of people make it seem. But once you get it, you're set for life. Once you understand the system, you're set for life. Remember that um, the idea behind these workers is that you don't need a lot of equipment. All you need is a pair of dumbbells. If you have kettlebells, great. Maybe a jump rope. If you have a jump rope, today we're going to use the jump rope. But that's about as much equipment as you need to get these workouts done. All right? So... Again, man, just be patient. Play your own music. Make sure you have good music in the background. I don't play music, copyright issues, but if you have your own music, play it. Make it loud, make it hype, make it fun. That is the whole point here is to have fun, get, get a good workout in, get a good sweat on, and, um, and just put in that work. Um, if you have a Fitbit smartwatch, at the five minute mark when I say we're ready to go, that's when I turn mine on to see how many calories I burn, how many active calories I burn, except, and that way I can track my calories. This is the best way to track your daily calories. It's, a, it's, it's always an estimate, but it's a, it's a reasonable estimate, which you can modify from there on to see where you need to be, okay? Um, so let me set up some things. Let me get this out of the way right here because I'm going to be doing jump ropes. We're going to be jump roping today. This needs to be out of the way. I got all my equipment. I need my water. Here it is. So I can stay hydrated while I'm working out. And we're about to go. So the way it works, we start with a pre-warm-up. The pre-warm-up is to identify any weaknesses. Uh, if you have shoulder problems, if you have knee problems, if you have lower back problems, we're going to try to... I created a... a I've created a, like 
pre warm up that if you do this three times on your own during the week, it's going to help you have stronger shoulders, stronger knees, stronger back, and you're going to be more flexible, more range of motion. You're going to feel just 10 times better. That is so good morning. So let's get started. So I'm going to turn on my watch. Put it in workout mode. And we're going to get going. All right. So we're going to start with the arm circles. For those of you who are new, remember the arm circles are awesome for me because when you open, you retract and you maintain that retraction of your shoulder blades. I want you to retract the shoulder blades, hold the squeeze as you do the arm circles with your arms locked and straight. When you do that, you're going to feel a burn on your shoulders. You're going to feel a burn on your upper back, on the shoulder blades. That's going to make your shoulder blades stronger and healthier. And if you can't do it, just practice it as often as you can. Always have good posture during these warm-ups. Do not lean back. We want in the workouts, our, our most basic position is to be here, crunch down, tight, glutes tight, abs tight, right? And, and just stable. Do not lean back ever unless we're doing an exercise like a back extension on the floor. We do not lean back. We do not do this unless I specifically ask for it, okay? And this goes for every single exercise. So we're going to start with the arm circles. You're going to come, you're going to open wide and you're going to retract your shoulder blades. You see how my shoulder blades disappear? So you're going to squeeze. If you don't know how to do that, I want you to roll, stick your chest out, hold the squeeze, open as wide as you can while you're holding that squeeze on the shoulder blades. Does not matter if you go forward, does not matter if you go backwards, just choose one direction, then we're gonna switch the direction. All right, so when I say arms open, it means this. When I say fingers up, it means this. When I say fingers down, it means that. All right, here we go. Retract those shoulder blades, hold the squeeze, let's start with those arm circles. Keep them small at first at the beginning, and as you get warmed up, you can make them a little bit bigger. Make sure you are consistently and constantly breathing. Keep those shoulder blades tight, fingers up, fingers down, fingers up, fingers down, and let's go over and under. Just like this, one arm goes over the top, one arm goes under, under the armpit, and you keep alternating which one does what. All right, next. Now we're gonna go switch, we're gonna switch the direction. So if you were going forward, now you're gonna go backwards. But same thing, you're gonna squeeze that upper back, hold those shoulder blades in place as you're doing the arm circles. So I went forward, now I'm gonna go backwards. Let's go. So and always breathing. Take those deep breaths, fingers up, fingers down, fingers up. Down and over and under. Whew. Second one is always a little shorter because our shoulders are already burning. Next, we're going to swing the arms back and up. You're going to try to get your arms as high as you can, again, without leaning back. That bicep should be in line with your ear. If you can only get up to here, you're like, oh, you can't get any higher than that. It probably means that you walk around like this, your shoulder is round. So this is tight. You gotta stretch this out. You gotta stretch your lats out. And then you gotta strengthen this movement and keeping this body in position. Again, if you can't go here, and you can only go up to here, that's fine. Take it step by step, work on the problem. Don't hide it by doing this, okay? So we're gonna swing back and up 10 times. Three, two, one, let's go. So swing. And raise one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Beautiful. All right. Always trying to keep those arms locked and straight. Next, we're going to go ahead and uh, we're going to go arm across right here and right here. We're going to go high, high, middle, middle low, low. So the high, my hand, my wrist is in line with my shoulders. The middle is in line with my obliques. 
and the load is below my hips. And as you pull, you're going to grab your arm, you're going to pull it. And as you pull, you're also going to twist as far as you can, warming up your hips, warming up that trunk, okay? So we're going to do two seconds on one, two seconds, two seconds, two seconds, two seconds, two seconds. Just follow along. Three, two, one. So just go arm across and twist as far as you can. One, two, and switch. One, two. Down the middle. One, two. Down the middle. One, two. Nice and low. One, two. Nice and low. One, two. Let's go high. One, two. Let's go high. One, two. Down the middle. One, two. Down the middle. One, two. Nice and low. One, two. Nice and low. One, two. Shake it off. Now, that warms up and stretches out this whole entire area. So keep in mind that if you are going only up to here on the arm swing and raise, if you're only going up to here, now you might be able to go here. If you were here, now you might be able to go here. If you're here, you might be able to go here. And if you can get to this point, you're probably just going to feel a lot more looser. All right? So we're going to do the same thing. Swing back and up 10 times. At the top, lock those arms straight. Three, two, one. Let's go. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine and ten. Woo! Shake it off. I feel good. Okay. Let's get into the legs. Let's get into the legs. We're gonna start with a march. Remember, when we march, my arms are chopping. Up and down, up and down. Whichever arm chops back, that's the leg that you lift. That's the leg that you lift. My arm chops back, that's the leg that I lift. Raise it as high as you can. Keep your core tight. The leg that's that's down. Stretch it out, so straighten it out and squeeze your butt. That's gonna give you balance and grab that knee and bring that knee as high as you can. One, one, two, two. We're gonna go for 10 reps. Ready? Three, two, one, let's go. So one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Fantastic. Next. We're gonna go ahead and kick back. Same thing, you're gonna march. Whichever arm kicks back, that's the leg that you kick back. You're gonna to try to bring your heel to your butt or heel to the hand, but just give me a maximum, maximum raise, maximum contraction on that hamstring. And uh, again, if you can't go all the way up, you only do what you can. Your, your mobility will get better with time so if you're limited with mobility, you work with what you got. Don't try to like cheat by leaning back or hunching down to try to get, no. Stay upright, try to do it as perfect as possible, even if you can't do the full range of motion, okay? So one, one, two, two, we're going for 10. Three, two, one, let's go. So one, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, and ten. Fantastic. Beautiful. Now, we're going to open wide, and we're going to go side. We're going to stretch side to side. Side to side. Warming up those inner thighs. If you can only go this high, then that's as high as you can go. If you can get all the way down, bending the knee into a side squat, get low into a side squat. Now, again... You only go as high as you can. We're gonna go one, one, two, two. Sorry, we're gonna go one, two with two second holds at each side. So you got two seconds to get a nice stretch, and then we're gonna go to the other side. So three, two, one, let's go. So one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one. Two, one, two, that's eight, one, I see a six. Let's do it, let's go four more. Ah, last one, nice and low. One, two, one, two. Beautiful. All right. Shake it off, shake it off, shake it off. Next, we're gonna go ahead and just do 10 
toe touches. I want you to get, do a, a nice little hip hinge, slight bend the knees, do not squat, so do not bring your butt down. So your butt is high, you just un unlock the knees, and then you're gonna drop your hips down as low as you can, and come up. We're gonna do 10 of those. Ready? Three, two, one, let's go. So just go as low as you can, and that's one. If you can only get up to here, that's fine. If you can get all the way down, get all the way down. That's three. That's four. That's five. That's six. That's seven. That's eight. That's nine. That's ten. Shake it off. Beautiful. Now we're going to do the exact same thing, but now we're going to open as wide as you can. I want you to open as wide as possible. All right, and you're going to go right down the middle and try to like just, if you want to cross your arms and just, you know, go, go under and reach far, go under and reach far. We're going, to, we're going to go three seconds to get your maximum stretch. If you can only go like here, one, two, three, right, and then just get, that's fine. But if you can get really low, get really low. We're going to do 10 of those. Get a nice, nice, deep stretch. Three, two, one, let's go. So one two three get up that's one one two three that's two one two three that's three let's go one two three that's four now since i'm almost in the split i'm just gonna keep my hands down let's go one two three that's five one two three that's six one, two, three, that's seven. One, two, three, that's eight. One, two, three, that's nine. One more. One, two, three, that's ten. Whew, I almost did the split. I almost went into a full split. But again, you only go as low as you're able to go and just get a shake off that leg. All right? So little by little, you start getting more mobile. Again, over time, it's taken me about a year and a half to get that deep. But again, it's going to take you about a year and a half to get that deep if you're not there yet. I started like this. I couldn't get any lower than that. Okay? I could not get any lower than that. Now I'm able to go into practically a full split, almost. So during the warm-up. Okay? So now we're going to go ahead now and do high knees. So high knees, I want you to be on the balls of your feet. Balls on your feet, you're going to chop as fast as you can. It's almost like a speed march. So when you're going here, remember the arm that kicks back, that's the leg that you lift. And you're going to go as fast as you can. One, one, two, two. We're going to go for 20. Three, two, one. Let's go. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. 20, fantastic. Now we're gonna go ahead and do the butt kick. Again, if you can't do a full butt kick in high speed like I'm doing it, you can march as fast as you can. Same thing with the high knees. You can march as fast as you can. We're gonna do 20, ready? Three, two, one, let's get it. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20. Woo! Beautiful, all right? Next, last one. We're going to do little jumps. So we're going to hop. Hands. Every time you hop and you jump, you tap, come down. If you can't jump, so go. Every time you get on the high point of your tippy toe, slap. Slap, slap, slap. But if you can jump, so down, jump, down, jump and slap, jump and slap, jump and slap. We're gonna do 30 of those. Ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, two, four, Six, eight, thirty. Beautiful. All right. So that is the end of the warm up, guys. No more warm up. 
What is the idea behind those, these jumps? If you don't have a jump rope, that's what you're gonna do. If you wanna do jumping jacks, you can do jumping jacks. More of a full body workout, right? You also get those shoulders involved. Um, if you wanna do like just calf raises, then just do calf raises, all right? And you're gonna do uh, 50 of those, all right? Um, that's pretty much it, right? You can also do calf raises with your knees bent, where you're nice and low, and you raise as high as you can, staying low. That's gonna work the soleus, so under the calf, under the gastro, that way you get the full. You can do 25, 25 straight like this, and then the other 25, you can do it like this, all right? If you don't have, if you don't have jump ropes. If you have jump ropes, just do the jump rope. Again, you can just go like this, or you can do jumping jacks. If you have a jump rope, use the jump rope. All right, so grab something to drink. We're gonna go ahead and get into the workout. So I'm gonna go through all five exercises. We're doing a simple ladder. One, two, three, four, five. Four, three, two, one. Five exercises, and, uh, and we'll go from there. When I'm explaining the exercises, what I'm explaining, stay moving, right? Give me some high knees, maybe to the side, just shake it off, move around, right? Just don't sit down and get cold. I'm gonna try to go through this as fast as possible so that we don't get as cold and we can kill it as soon as I'm done explaining. So we're starting with the jump ropes. I already told you what you guys need to do, either here, right, or jumping jacks, run in place, calf raises, calf raises, all right, it's up to you, um, you can mix it up, mix and match, whatever you want to do, but we have 50, all right, Woo! hello, good morning, good morning, Simena, I'll read it right now, I'll read it right now, all right, next guys, we got a squat, squat to pick up deadlift, so what is a squat to pick up deadlift? Ideally, I want you to bring the, the dumbbells to the floor. If you can't, go as low as you can. But what we're going to do is we're going to do a squat. So we're going to start in this position right here. We're going to squat. Bring the dumbbells down to the floor in front of me. Get in position. And then do a pickup deadlift. So squat. You can come to the front. Pick up deadlift. Squat. Drive the hip up. Deadlift. So, you get your booty down here, then when you bring the dumbbells forward, you go into this position, a slight hinge, and then from here, you lift, all right? So it's not a squat, it's a squat to pick up deadlift, all right? If you can't, then just do Romanian deadlifts. Bring it all the way to the floor, bring it all the way down, or actually for this one, just do squats, all right? Just do squats. All right, if you can't, if you don't understand or you can't do the pickup deadlift. If you can only get this low, then that's as low as you can go. You go as low as you're able to go. You can even just do like a half squat and then try to mimic the deadlift. Half squat, mimic the deadlift, all right? So you go from the side into the squat, bring the weights forward, deadlift, and you go as low as you can. But well, we got 10 of those. From there, from there, we got walking lunges. So a walking lunge, all right? One, two, turn around. One, two, turn around. We're gonna do three, three, back and forth. So one, two, three, all right? For a total of 12 walking lunges. Then we're gonna do a deadlift to pick up squats. Now we're gonna do backwards. So it's a deadlift, so remaining deadlift nice and slow all the way to the ground. When you get to the floor, come up. So you, my hip stays high. Once I get to the bottom, I drop my hip and I come up to, the, to a squat, all right? We're gonna do 10, 10 of those, all right? Again, you do your best. If you can't do the squat again, just do the deadlifts. Just do the deadlifts, all right? And then the last one, it's 10 reps 
we're gonna do a, a clean to a split jerk. So with the dumbbell, we're gonna be here. We're gonna do a clean, come up, and then quick speed, split, whatever arm you, you, you jerk with, opposite leg is gonna go forward, bring it down, switch, swing and switch, clean, come up, core tight, deep breath, right? So actually other leg, sorry. So come back down and then we keep switching. So if uh, an easier version, right? They say you, you don't know how to clean, just bring it up to the shoulder if you can, or here, doesn't really matter here. This is more efficient, right? And then you can step back and do a little bit of a press, right? Bring it down, bring it up to the shoulder. Now, we're gonna, now I'm gonna split with this leg forward, right? So I'm gonna step back. So whichever leg I'm holding the dumbbell, that's the leg that I'm gonna step back, all right? So here, all right, I'm gonna step back with the same side, all right? Um, but if you can, if you can do the clean, you can even do like a, like a just, just here, do a squat, step back, all right? Again, you can go here, all right? Squat. Step back. But if you know how to do the clean and jerk, then you know how to do the clean and jerk, right? And again, you're gonna step back with the same side. So if it's a split, boom. Other side, boom. Quick, locked, explosive. One to 10 of those. And that's gonna be the end of the, uh, the ladder. So one, two, three, four, five, four, three, two, one. Round one, we do it once. Round two, we do it twice, all right? So, for those of you who are right new to the channel, round one, I expect you to use, or I recommend, as, a, as your trainer, as your programmer, I recommend you go light. Focus only on technique. Just get a sweat going. Round two, pick up the weight that is your working weight, whether it's for muscle building, strength training, or muscular endurance, Choose the program, choose the weight that's gonna push you the most, but at the right weight for the specific program, okay? So, whoo! Ah, okay, okay, Simena, tranquila, felicidades. Felicidades. All right. Felicidades de tu niña, okay? Felicidades de tu niña. Y vamos a darle duro siempre. Tú sabes que tú siempre lo puedes hacer en replay. Mientras vengas, no hay problema. All right, so let's get it, guys. Let's get it. Here we go. All right. <laughs> Vamos, Marisol. All right, here we go. One more sip. One more sip. We're going to go right into the workout. All right, so grab your jump rope or do the uh, choose one of the ones that you're going to do. All right, so I'm going to use 25s for the warm up. All right. So I'm gonna get my jump rope. All right, and here we go. So we got 50, 50 jump ropes. Ready? Three, two, one. Let's get it going. Let's go. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, two, four, six, eight, 30, 2, 4, 6, 8, 40, 2, 4, 6, 8, 50. Beautiful. All right. Squat to pick up deadlift. All right. Squat to pick up deadlift. Again, if you can only do squats, just do your squats. We got 10 reps. If you can do the squat to deadlift, do the squat to pick up deadlift. 3, 2, 1. Let's go. So deep squat. Bring the waist forward, drive your hips up, and pick up. One, squat, straighten out your butt, come up, that's two. Squat, straighten out your butt, that's three. Squat, straighten out your butt, that's four. Squat, straighten out your butt, that's five. Squat, 
Straighten out your butt. That's six. Squat. Straighten out your butt. Seven. Squat. High butt. Eight. Down. High butt. Nine. Squat. High butt. Ten. All right? Beautiful. So remember, when you think about it, think about low butt, high butt. Low butt, high butt. All right? So that's one way you can think about it in order to understand the squat to the pickup deadlift. Walking lunges. Walking lunges. Here we go. So two steps forward, two steps back. A total of 12 reps. Three, two, one. Let's go. Down. That's two, three, four. Lunge. Five. Lunge. Six. Lunge. Seven. Lunge. Eight. Lunge. Nine, lunge, ten, two more, lunge, eleven, lunge, twelve, beautiful, Woo! all right, and now we got deadlift to pick up squat, all right, deadlift to pick up squat, here we go, three, two, one, let's get it, so deadlift, Deep as you can go, squat, bring it up, one, then lift, deep, booty low, get up, that's two, booty high, booty low, that's three, booty high, booty low, that's four, booty high, booty low, that's six, booty high, Booty low. That's seven. Booty high. Booty low. That's eight. Booty high. Booty low. That's nine. Booty high. Booty low. That's ten. Beautiful. All right. Now we got cleans to jerks. All right. Cleans to jerks. I'm going to start with the right arm, and then I'm going to swing, switch to my left. Swing, switch to my right. Swing, switch to my left after every rep, right? So I'm going to jerk it, then I'm going to bring it back and go to the next one, right? Here we go. Three, two, one. Let's go. So clean, right? And that's one. Swing and switch. Clean. And that's two. Swing and switch. Come up. And jerk. That's three. Reset. Clean. That's four. Let's go. That's five. Jerk it. That's six. Swing and switch. Clean. Jerk. That's seven. Swing and switch. Clean. Jerk. That's eight. Two more. Clean. Jerk. That's nine. One more. Clean, jerk, that's 10. Woo! Beautiful, all right? Deep breath, two. Now we're going back to the deadlift, two, squat. So nice hip hinge, high booty, into low booty, all right? Here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Hip hinge, get all the way down to the floor. Low booty, get up. That's one. Down. Low booty. Two. Down. Low booty. 
three. Down. Low booty. Four. Down. Low booty. Five. Down. Low booty. Six. Down. Low booty. Seven. Down. Low booty. Eight. Two more. Down. Low booty. Nine. One more. Down. Low booty. Ten. Beautiful. Woo! And now we got walking lunges. Walking lunges. We got twelve. Here you go. Three, two, one. Let's go. One, two. Switch. Down. Down. That's four. Lunge. Lunge. That's six. Lunge. Lunge. That's eight. Lunge. Lunge. That's ten. Two more. Lunge. Lunge. That's twelve. Woo! Beautiful. All right. Now we got squat to pick up deadlift. Squat to pick up deadlift. Here we go. Three, two, one. Let's get it. Squat. Booty up. Pick up deadlift. One. So squat. Pick up. Hip high. That's two. Squat. Hip high. That's three. Squat. Hip high. That's four. Squat. Hip high. That's five. Squat. Hip high. That's six. Squat. Hip high. That's seven. Squat. Hip high. That's eight. Squat. Hip high. That's nine. Squat. Hip high. That's ten. Woo! And last but not least, we have jump ropes. We got 50. 50. Ready? Three, two, one. Let's get it. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixty, eighty, twenty, two, four, six, eight, thirty, two, four, six, eight, forty, two, four, six, eight, fifty. Woo! And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the end of round one, right? Quick, to the point, and effective. So notice how, even though I use light weights, for me, right, light weights, super light weights, I'm still sweating like crazy. Still sweating like crazy, all right? So that's what you want your warm-up to be, your warm-up round, is to sweat, but have perfect technique as possible. You're trying to hit every single muscle, you're trying to feel every single muscle, and you're trying to engage everything, core, glutes. You're engaging your entire body, right? And you're thinking, you're going slow, methodically. It should be a perfect, perfect, uh, perfect set with perfect reps. Or as perfect as possible. Now, round two. Round two is different. Round two, you're going to go heavier. Round two, you're going to choose your program. Um, if you're doing endurance, you can probably still get away with uh, having really good technique. At the heavy you go, you start losing technique a little bit. Ideally, you want to be perfect with your technique. But when you start hitting that 80, 85%, you start losing technique, and that's where you should stop. So you're trying to reach 80 to 85%, maybe even 90% of your max effort, and you're done 
at that weight. So, and again, it all depends on what program. If you're doing strength, you're doing less reps to that 80%, 80 to 90%. If you're doing muscle building, you're doing about seven reps, right? To about 80, 90% max effort. And if you're doing endurance, you're going anywhere from 10 to 20 reps, 10 to 20 reps, trying to get to that 80, 90% um, max effort. So I'm gonna put these away. And I'm going to use, now, in today's workout, the way it's designed right today is like you can do number two and number four for strength, three to five, or for muscle building, seven reps. All right, you can definitely do it, but don't go for 15. We're gonna we're gonna stick to 10 because it's almost like we're doing two separate movements, all right? Almost like it, not really, but we are. All right, so um. Same thing with walking lunges. If you want to go heavy and you want to get, let's say, six lunges, by all means, go heavy and just get six, but don't injure yourself. Be smart. Know what you can handle. Know what your body can handle, all right? And the clean and jerks, again, challenging weights. The clean and jerk is a very uh, complicated exercise. We're doing high reps. We're doing it for 10. I want you to go moderate weight, moderate, all right? So, woo, Marisol Olguita. Here we go. Let's finish it, right? Let's go. Let's finish. Uh, let's get the second round going. All right, let's get it going. Let's kill it. Grab some of the drink. Let's get after it. Let's get after it, all right? So I'm going to use 50s. So I'll, I'll put them later. So I'm going to use the 50s. Uh, 50 pounds. So I use 25s for my warm-up. I'm going to use 50s. And again, it all depends how effective I am. If I see I'm losing technique, I'm stopping where I reach my maximum, all right? So let's get going. Round two should be more intense, heavier weights, be smart, all right? I'm gonna go a little faster because right now you should know that you should get the hang of it. You should know what to expect. So we're gonna move a little faster, all right? Here we go, 50 jump ropes. Jog in place, jump and tap, whatever, jumping jacks, calf raises, choose one. We got 50. Three, two, one, let's go. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, two, four, six, eight, 30, two, four, six, eight, 40, two, four, six, eight, 50, beautiful. All right, squat to pick up deadlift. Going with the 50s. Ah. All right, so my breaks are probably gonna be a little bit longer now, all right, because it's so heavy. So again, you guys go with me, all right? You do whatever you can do in the time that it gets me, uh, takes me to finish, all right? Here we go, three, two, one, Let's go. So squat, deadlift, one. Squat, deadlift, two. Squat, deadlift, three. Squat, deadlift, four. Squat, deadlift, five. Squat, deadlift, six. Squat, Deadlift, seven. Squat, deadlift, eight. Squat, deadlift, nine. Squat, deadlift, ten. Woo! Beautiful, all right? Deep breath. Walking lunges, walking lunges, all right? We got 12. Woo! Three, two, one, let's go. Lunge, lunge, that's two. Lunge, lunge, that's four. Lunge, lunge, that's six. Lunge, 
lunge. That's eight. Lunge. Lunge. That's ten. Lunge. Lunge. That's twelve. Woo! Ha! Ah. Deep breath. We got deadlift to pick up squat. All right. So now notice with the 50s, I'm not bringing them in front. It's too heavy for me to bring them in front. So I'm just leaving them right on the side. I do the deadlift and the squat with the weights right in front of me. I don't turn them all the way, right? Because it's heavier, all right? All right, here we go. So we're gonna go, we're gonna pick up the weight, do the eccentric on the way down, right? Let it rest, get into your squat position, and drive it up with your legs. So use those legs to pick up that weight. Here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Deadlift. Squat. One. Deadlift. Squat. That's two. Deadlift. Squat. That's three. Deadlift. Squat. That's four. Deadlift. Squat. That's five. Deadlift. Squat. That's six. Deadlift. Squat. That's seven. Deadlift. Squat. That's eight. Deadlift. Squat. That's nine. Deadlift. Squat. That's ten. Woo! Beautiful, huh? Now we got swing, clean, and jerk. We got ten. Deep breath. One more. Here we go. Three, two, one. Let's get it. So, clean, jerk. That's one. Swing and switch. Clean. That's two. Swing. Switch. That's three. Clean. That's four. Swing. Clean. That's five. Clean. That's six. Clean. That's seven. Clean. That's eight. Two more. Clean. That's nine. Last one. Clean. That's ten. Woo! Grass over the drink. The heavier you go, the more intense it is, right? So the longer your breaks can be. Again, go with me. All right, go with me as much as you can. Ah, here we go. Couple deep breaths. We got deadlift to pick up squat. All right. Here we go. We got 10. Three, two, one. Let's get it. Deadlift. Pick up squat. One. Deadlift. 
Think of squat. Two. Deadlift. Think of squat. Three. Deadlift. Think of squat. Four. Deadlift. Think of squat. Five. Deadlift. Think of squat. Six. Deadlift. Think of squat. Seven. Deadlift. Think of squat. Eight. Deadlift. Think of squat. Nine. One more. Deadlift. Think of squat. Ten. Woo! Now using 50s for every exercise, my grip needs a little bit of time to recover. So I'm gonna take an extra few seconds just to let my grip recover, all right? But it's strong enough where I don't need straps. But if you're stuck, right, where your grip is not allowing you to get the heaviest weight possible, buy yourself a pair of straps. That way you can hold the weight with the straps. All right. Here we go. Walking lunges. Three, two, one. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Turn around. Five, six. Turn around. Lunge. Lunge. That's eight. Four more. Lunge. Lunge. Last two. Lunge. Lunge. Woo! Deep breath. All right. We got squat to pick up deadlift. Squat to pick up deadlift. Woo! Guys, my butt is on fire. Holy smokes. It's on fire. Here we go. Squat to pick up deadlift. Deep breath. Pick up those weights. Let's go. Squat. Pick up that. One. Squat. Pick up that. Two. Squat. Pick up that. Three. Squat. Pick up that. Four. Squat. Pick up that. Five. Squat. Pick up that. Six. Squat. Pick up that. Seven. Squat. Pick up that. Eight. Squat. Pick up that. Nine. Squat. Pick up that. Ten. Woo! We got jump ropes. Fifty singles. Holy smoke, this is hard. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Let's get it. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, two, four, six, eight, thirty, two, four, six, eight, eight, forty, two, four, six, eight. 50. Woo! One more. Half round. Grab some of the drink. Here we go. Ah. Booty's on fire. All right. So starting with the squat to pick up deadlift. Right back, right back to it. Woo! Booty is on fire. On fire. Here we go. Three, two, one. 
three, two, one, let's go. Squat, pick up deadlift, one, squat, pick up deadlift, two, squat, three, squat, deadlift, four, squat, deadlift, five, squat, deadlift, six, squat, deadlift, seven, squat, deadlift, eight, squat, deadlift, nine, squat, deadlift, ten, Woo. Ha. deep breath, walking lunges, walking lunges, we got 12, all right, stay strong, three, two, one, let's go, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, 12. Woo! My grip was giving out, but I told my brain, don't drop them. Don't drop them. All right. We have deadlift to pick up squat. Woo! Ah, so eccentric on the deadlift and then squat down and stand up. So high booty, low booty, stand up. High booty, low booty, stand up. We got 10. Three, two, one. So high booty deadlift. No. Stand up, that's one. Slow control, stand up, that's two. Slow, stand up, three. Low, stand up, four. Low, stand up, five. Low, stand up, six. Low, stand up, seven. Low, stand up, eight, low, stand up, nine, low, stand up, ten, Woo! holy smokes, I am profusely sweating, profusely, let me get a little bit of chalk, pull his cleans, last set of cleans, Last set of cleans. All right. Here we go. Ten of these. Remember, however you're able to do it, whether it's just press and step back, or don't even step back, just do a press and keep switching. All right? Keep switching. Whatever you can do. Try to do as much of the movements as you can. Here we go. Three. Two, one, let's get it. Clean. Jump. One, switch. Clean. Jump. That's two. Clean. Jump. That's three. Clean. Jerk. 
Last four. Pain. Jerk. Last five. Clean. Last six. Clean. Jerk. Last seven. Clean. Jerk. That's eight. Clean. Jerk. That's nine. One more. Clean. Jerk. That's ten. Woo! A little bit of water. Four more exercises. Four more. Ah, here we go. Deadlift to pick up squat. Here we go. Here we go. Deadlift, squat. One, deadlift, squat. Two, deadlift. Squat, three, deadlift, squat, four, deadlift, squat, five, deadlift, squat, six, deadlift, squat, seven, deadlift, squat, eight, deadlift, squat, nine, deadlift, Squat. Ten. Ah. Woo. Deep breath. I'm giving my my I'm giving my my grip my grip a rest. Ah. Here we go. We got twelve walking lunges. If you do less, you do less. All right. Just do your best. That's all I can ask. Here we go. Three, two, one, let's go. Lunge. Lunge. That's two. Lunge. Lunge. That's four. Lunge. Lunge. That's six. Lunge, lunge, that's eight, lunge, lunge, that's ten, lunge, lunge, that's twelve, Woo! two more exercises, squat, to pick up deadlifts. The hard part is over. Woo. Here we go. Squat to pick up deadlifts. Three, two, one. Let's go. So squat, booty high, deadlifts. That's one. Squat, booty high. That's two. Squat, booty high. That's three. Squat, booty high. That's four. Squat, booty high. That's five. Squat, booty high. That's six. Squat, booty high. That's seven. Squat, booty high. That's eight. Squat. Booty high, that's nine, one more. Squat, booty high, 
Last 10. Last but not least. Last but not least. Jump ropes. Woo! 50. Here we go. Three, two, one. Let's get it. Oops. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixty, eighty, twenty, two, four, six, eight, thirty, two, four, six, eight, forty, two, four, six, eight, fifty. Holy smokes. Holy smokes. Holy smokes. That was brutal. I did not expect this workout to be so good. So good. Oh, man. Ah, one of the best leg days. This right here is a complete... Complete leg day. We got everything in. Everything. Wow. All I gotta say is if you did this workout, right? I don't care how you did it. If you did the whole workout, if you were here, even if you did less reps, whatever, all right? Tap yourself on the shoulder. All right? Thank your body and power. All right? That was fantastic. I can't express to you guys how awesome this was today. Woo! I'm definitely earned my meals today. I'm gonna earn my rest. And man, what a beautiful way to start the weekend, all right? So, man, congratulations, man. This was an awesome workout. This was a great workout. Man, I would recommend you guys do it twice. Maybe do it like on a Tuesday or Thursday of next week. Do it again. This workout is phenomenal, all right? We burn a lot of calories, right? 623 according to my watch for me. But it's going to be a lot more because it was so intense. So, guys, congratulations. Thank you so much for the support. Keep sharing the channel. Share your experience. Hit the like button. Right? Tag me on Instagram. Tag me on Facebook. Go to my Facebook page and share it on your, on your wall. All right? And uh, just share it on your wall. Facebook is probably a little bit better. Facebook and Instagram work together. So, if you can share from my page into your Facebook, just share it, all right? And again, guys, thank you so much for showing up. I appreciate you all. Hugs, kisses, God bless everybody. Woo, let's see. Marisol. <laughs> Look at this, guys. Look at this. This is real sweat. Real, all right? I am pouring in sweat. Woo! Kelly, verdad que sí, hay que llamar a los bomberos, verdad que sí. Olguita, beautiful job. Simena, everybody who's here, man. Marisol, everyone. Kelly, guys, awesome, beautiful job, man. I'll see you on Monday for chest, shoulders. I'm going to bring it down a little bit because this, is, this, was, this was awesome today. So, again, guys, thank you so much. I'll see you on the next workout. Woo! Yes, verdad que sí, Kelly. Este sí tuvo mortal. Bye, everybody. I'll see you in the next one.